I bet with Interbet only. They're a fantastic site. I've never had any issues with them. They are very professional. There's never a problem. You deposit money, two seconds later it's in your account. You withdraw, which I do very occasionally. And uh, I believe it's also two seconds it's in your account. Race number three on the program, the start of uh, the pick six. MR 64 handicap, 1700 meters a trip, half past two, the time that, uh, half past one rather, the time that you need to get your bets on for uh, leg number one of that pick six. Favorite is Pascali, horse number two at 22 to 10 in the market. Exceed expectation, 28 to 10. It is uh, Rafiki, six to one, five to one. Head Gardner, seven to one into 11 to two. Fever, 10 to one into eight to one, and it's 10 to one and better by those. There's been a bit of support for a number of runners in this event and you can see why because it's not the strongest of races. This horse, uh, Pascali, he's taken a huge drop in class. He's been racing against much stronger. He's drawn in gate number two. He goes over 1700 meters which I think is is the right distance for him. He's a horse that I think will even get will even get 10 furlongs just based on his pedigree. And I think Garth Puller has found the right type of opening for this horse to notch up his second career victory. So I think he's the horse to beat. Exceed expectation. Last time out, I think you can just go and uh, pull that uh, rerun out and you can watch that rerun and you'll be able to uh, make a decision for yourself based on that performance. I think he should go very, very close in this event. Uh, unlucky last time out. Daryl Daniels gets the ride once again and uh, he'll definitely be looking to get this one into the winner's enclosure. So uh, numbers two and seven for me to fight it out in this event, Sheldon, but I would be with horse number two, uh, Pascali. We've got the exact same exacta here, numbers two from seven. Number two, Pascali, I believe this will definitely be the horse to beat. Garth Puller's got quite a strong hand here because he's also got number five, Bob Batty, and that ran alongside Exceed Expectation last time out. So that's a nice one for the swingers. But Pascal, if you go back in his earlier form lines, they were trying him over different trips. They put the blinkers on over 1,200 in a merit rate at 80. He ran just over six lengths behind Beechamwood Boy. We've seen how many races Beechamwood Boy has won. And then they've tried him over the trip which he's been crying out for. The average rating he's lost two runs is a 71. He's had three runs on the poly for two fourth placings. But in this type of company, number two, Pascali, merit rated 64 handicap. I don't think they'll find an easier opportunity. So quietly confident about number two, Pascali. And then number seven, exceed expectation. I want to forget that last run. It became an absolute nightmare. I really fancied him last time out. And like you mentioned, the viewers must go back and watch that replay. He's a horse who's, he's had his excuses, but last time out there were so many excuses, you can write a book about it. Yeah. So exceed expectation. Daryl Daniels will be looking to bounce back on this individual. Number five, Barbati is worth throwing in. And then looking after those horses, Perhaps a horse like number three, Omar, word it's Roy for the trifectus quartets and head gardener. But two Pascalia, number seven, exceed expectation. I expect him to finish in that order. Yeah, absolutely. Those are the two numbers that uh, you, I think you can play around in race uh, number three, the first leg after pick six, and you should be safe for those two numbers. And uh, by part place by part place pick six, I think two and seven should be good enough. Uh, my name's Danny Deliberto, founder of Ladles of Love. It was founded back in 2014. Communities we, we work with are all over the peninsula and um, we're working with 138 beneficiaries now. We've grown exponentially. Um, we've been able to do that because of all the kindness that we have experienced um, from individuals and corporates such as uh, Interbet who just want to be part of the change.